Mother confronts man who was taking pictures of her young daughter in an amusement park line. More after this. Hello everyone and welcome back to AG's Point of View, where I give you my analysis on the most popular topics in the world today. In today's video, we have a man who's taking pictures of underage little girls while they're with their mother, at least trying to sneak take pictures. Before I dive into the details of the video, if you're new here, welcome. Welcome to AG's Point of View. Do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button as well. There'll be more awesome, loving, and wonderful people over, similar to yourself. All my normal subscribers, thanks for coming back. I'm diving in. A recording of an incident that occurred at Six Flags Amusement Park in Vallejo, California, went viral many, as, after many people sympathized with a woman who was very openly yelling at a man while they stood and waited in line for a ride. After being reposted to the subreddit, the video received tens of thousands of upvotes, which was commented nearly 2,000 times. The mother, um, the video opens with the mother, you know what? Instead of me talking about what the video says, how about you take a look at the video now? And we'll be right back, right after this. Go to this this gallery. is over here taking pictures of little girls. Okay. And either y'all gonna take him or y'all gonna take me. I got you. Why do you got my daughter in your phone? Why do you got my daughter in your phone? I'm keeping the list. Why the fuck do you got my daughter in your phone? Delete it right now, first. You taking pictures of little girls? Fucking God, you fucking pervert. Not even Get my daughter out your damn phone. Read your face, bitch. Delete my daughter's picture out your goddamn phone. Delete my daughter's picture out your goddamn phone. Her picture right, out your phone. Right, right. You are a Okay. My man was a creep, straight up and down. Ain't no other way of going around it. He was a straight up creep. Now, kudos to the mom that stepped up to the plate and did what she needed to do. And shout out to that young man over there that was right there, okay? Making sure that everything was all good. Because I promise you, if she was by herself and she ain't handled no backup, trust me, my man would have tried to try some fly shit and, you know what I mean, tried to, you know, act like, you know what I mean, woman, get out of here. Might have tried to be on some, you know, hitter or something like that. You know what I mean? It was nice that my man stepped up, which, you know, that's what we need to start doing these days. You know what I'm saying? And the fact that he's sitting there taking pictures of little girls, what was that all about? You know what I'm saying? Why was you taking pictures of little underage girls at an amusement park. What was you gonna do with those pictures? Huh? What were you gonna do with those pictures? See, it's a lot of men out here that's sick in the head. You know what I'm saying? They they preying on young people, okay? And they acting like, you know, well, what I'm doing is, is normal. It's not normal, bro. You sick in the head. You know what I'm saying? Listen, let me explain something to you. If my man got caught up, is a pedophile. You doing what you doing. You hit the prison block, you already know, dog. It's a wrap. Somebody about to get on you real quick. It ain't gonna be a pleasant visit. I'll tell you that right now, dog. You're gonna wish you never did that. It might end up shanking you and killing you in, in prison. You know what I'm saying? So, I mean, dudes like that need to get dealt with early in the game. And I'm so glad that she stepped up to the plate. And I'm so glad my man stepped up to the plate too. Because I already know, you know what I'm saying? Something like that. She could have felt like you know, sometimes we don't always think, you know what I'm saying, with something like that jump off. Like, what if my man would have jumped off or something and did some crazy and goofy stuff? And then you got your kids and everything's wild? Like, nah. Like, if I'm out and about, me and my daughter doing some stuff, we hanging out, we doing a good, having a good time, doing some stuff that we always wanted to do, go swimming or whatever the case may be, and we got a creep over here taking pictures. Now, as a father, I want to rip your fucking head off. Excuse my French, you know what I'm saying? But I can't go out there and do something like that, especially if it's just me and her. You know what I'm saying? Because I got to make sure I'm doing everything in my power to make sure that she's safe. Now, I can wild out and do all I want I'm going to do. Then who's going to be here for her? Now, she's really vulnerable because she's there by herself. And now I'm over here and you taking me in. You know what I mean? Now, we separated. You see what I'm saying? So, I got to think the whole process through. You know what I'm saying? I may, not, I may not like that. You know what I'm saying? What I might end up doing, something like that. Listen, 
I might make a phone call. I'm like, yo, somebody come through. I don't care who it is, mom, grandma, whoever, you know what I'm saying, family members or whatever, make sure you safe, you know what I'm saying, then I get to work, because I'm going to follow you around, because I'm going to make sure you you know, you know get dealt with. It ain't sweet, because it ain't sweet. I don't, listen, there's one thing I don't play, is that creepy stuff with my kids, you know what I'm saying, or even with someone else's kids. I'm not going to just neglect somebody else's kids and be like, especially if I see, I, I, you know, I can stand in the gap and protect them from having to deal with some creepiness or something like that is going down, you know what I mean? Because these dudes is all about pedophilia, you know what I'm saying? It's like, you got to watch them, man. It's a lot of crazy and sick individuals out here, which I don't understand because guess what? Just as sick as just as just sick as you are, okay, it's a female out there, you know what I mean? That's equivalent to you that if you feel like you want to do some sick and nasty stuff, it's a grown woman over there. You can handle your business, you know what I'm saying? And then on top of that, it's just like people just feel like I just feel like nowadays it's like it's 2023 and nowadays everybody got a camera. It's a camera up every two minutes, every two minutes. Somebody filming something, filming something, you know, what I mean, taking pictures, of this, taking pictures of that unauthorized pictures, unauthorized videos. You see what I'm saying? They just taking videos of everything. I'm quite sure I'm on several videos. I don't know what the hell. I don't know how, but I'm on several videos. <laughs> You could be on several videos. You could be on someone's camera roll. You, you never know. You don't know what's going on here. People could be sitting there acting like they're scrolling through the, you know, their timeline or whatever. They checking something on Instagram or, or Twitter or whatever the case may be. And they could just be snapping away. Bang, 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 bang. You in a, you know, you in a in a compromising situation. A woman walking around, she got a little bit of cleavage. My man, chick, 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 chick. You know what I'm saying? You bend over, chick, 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 chick. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? They do the same thing to kids. And just because you feel like, you know, you're a parent, oh, it only happens to little girls. No, it happens to little boys, too. Because there's men out here taking pictures of little boys, too. You know what I'm saying? So don't think as you just got a son that that don't happen. No. Because it happens to both parties, okay? So you got to really be conscious. You got to be careful. You got to keep your head on the swivel and make sure everything is on point. Thank God she was on point. You see what I'm saying? Because she could have been slipping. My man could have, you know, looked some stuff up, could have, you know, found out where he was at, kind of, you know, do something. You know, some of these dudes weird and they computer geniuses, okay? Somehow, some way, get up into her phone, you know, send her a message or something. Hey, little girl, meet me here, meet me there. Anything can happen. There's a lot of kids that got abducted in situations like that, you know what I'm saying? And men doing all types of weird, nasty things. So... Kudos to the mom. I'm glad she caught this ball. I'm glad she did everything she needed to do. And I'm glad that my man said to the play too. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, shout out to both of them and to the slug that went out there and was doing all the flicking and all that. You know what I'm saying? I hope you get dealt with on a personal level. I hope someone get down and dirty with you and stomp you the fuck out straight up because you ain't, you know what? You know what I'm saying? And, um, you know, excuse my French, this type of stuff triggers me and I don't like that. I don't like that, that nasty shit with the kids. I don't like that. Leave the kids alone. They ain't bothering nobody. Let them grow up to be adults. You know what I'm saying? Let them live their own life. You know what I'm saying? If they want to get with you when they become an adult, by all means, that's something else. But while they kids, leave them the fuck alone. Period. Okay? And I mean that for everything. You know what I'm saying? So, but with that being said, if you like what you've heard, please don't hesitate to hit the subscribe button down below. Hit the like button as well. Bring more awesome, loving, and wonderful people over. Similar to yourself. All my normal subscribers, thanks for coming back. Thanks for showing out on the like button. Thanks for showing out for sharing. Um, we steadily growing, growing, growing. And it's all because of you guys. I definitely appreciate it. I thank you so much. This channel is definitely nothing without you. Continue to share. Continue to like. Continue to, you know, visit me on my social media platforms listed below. TikTok, Instagram, Twitter. You know what I'm saying? I'm over there all the time. You may not see a lot of content on Twitter, but you will see content on Instagram. And you will see content on TikTok. So I'm working my way to Twitter, but I haven't gotten there yet. So, you know, but I still got a tagline. So every once in a while, I, you know, pop something over there too. So don't just neglect it. I, you, if you see me, you know I'm there. So, but with that being said, I love every single one of y'all. Thank y'all for coming out watching the video. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.